Pickle juice makes sure they're held easily within your reach. Folks, please stay seated while the train's in motion. Keep those arms and legs and especially your heads inside the rail car at all times. And please refrain from smoking, eating, or drinking anything but water aboard the line of the railroad. And as we continue on now through the Porches and Parlors District, we're now passing the historic Susquehanna Plantation, built in 1835 in St. Mary's County, Maryland. It was owned by Henry and Elizabeth Carroll, a prosperous family who held lavish parties in that plantation house. Compare that to that small red house next door, that's the Thomas Clinton home. Thomas was an indentured servant. He lived in that small one-room house with his wife and seven children. At the end of the road is our Daggett Bar, a living history bar from 1754 in Andover, Connecticut. Stop in and see how Samuel Daggett and the family lived their work on the farm prior to the American Revolution. Henry Ford Academy is a charter school here in Wayne County. Students attend for free, but 
were chosen by lottery. This portion of the campus houses the 10th, 11th, and 12th grades, 9th graders, and 10th class at the Abbey Ford Museum. Just up ahead, you'll see three attached rail cars. They serve as classrooms to the senior class. Also, we use it as headquarters for our summer camp series. Wait for the whistle. And there it is. 